Lucas Torreira was once again the hero for Arsenal on Saturday as his 83rd minute bicycle kick sealed an important 1-0 victory against Huddersfield. Arsenal had plenty of chances to score throughout the game but Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and Alexandre Lacazette didn't have their shooting boots on. Lacazette did have the ball in the back of the net just before half-time, admittedly. But after rounding goalkeeper Jonas Lossler and scoring the referee controversially blew for offside. In the end it was up to Torreira to save the day as the Uruguayan acrobatically fired home from Orbeman's inch perfect cross. He now has two goals in three games for Arsenal, with the other coming during last Sunday's 4-2 victory against Tottenham in the North London derby. Arsenal fans have only had a couple of months to get to know Torreira but they absolutely adore him and regard him as the defensive midfielder they've needed for so long. Torreira may only be 5'6 and 22 years old, but he's deceivingly strong, intelligent and extremely composed on the ball. However, there was one moment in the second half where he really let himself down. Granit Xhaka, Shkodran Mustafi and Matteo Guindalzi were all booked against Huddersfield for simulation and footage has emerged showing Torreira was also guilty of play acting. In the video below, Torreira flicks the ball past Aaron Mui and gets brushed in the face yet goes to ground like he's been punched. Poor Dr. Rira managed to trick the referee into giving Arsenal a free kick with his play acting, but this is an issue you know Emery must address immediately. Having three players booked in one game for simulation is rather embarrassing and it should really have been four with Torreira's dive. Emery did speak about his players' behaviour after the game and insisted that simulation is something he never wants to see, even if it works. I don't want simulation for players Emery said in his post-match press conference. I want more rhythm in the match. The opposition can decide how they want to play and for me it is a tough match for that because they stopped a lot in fouls and these yellow cards are good.